Look. What? Look. How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some scary videos that are starting to spook the internet. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more freaky content. Just like this. A family in Missouri, USA claims to have caught the moment their toddler was harassed by some kind of paranormal entity. In May 2022, the parents of this toddler were shocked to see an eerie moment captured on their baby cam. Take a look. Watching that again, the toddler appears to be sleeping peacefully. When suddenly, it looks like something pushes the child. At a loss to explain the bizarre event, the family turned to the paranormal for an explanation, believing some kind of presence may have pushed their child. Many viewers agree with the parents and believe that the motion looks like a deliberate shove. Others tried to reassure the parents that it was nothing more than a fitful twitch and that the poor child simply woke herself up. But what do you think? Was the child pushed or woke up with a start? Let me know where you land on this in the comments down below. <laughs> this next eerie photo was uploaded to our Facebook community page by Jocelyn DeVault. Jocelyn writes, This picture is about 10 years old. The cousin of my daughter's friend was babysitting this young girl and was taking photos of her dancing to a Disney movie. This very creepy dark figure showed up behind her in one of the photos. This is 100% authentic and very upsetting to all involved. In the picture, you can indeed see a shadowy figure standing behind the young girl. It's dense and amorphous and seems to be devoid of light altogether. In a follow-up comment, Jocelyn notes that she expects doubters and that it's good to be skeptical and agrees that the photo is almost hard to believe but maintains that the image is 100% real. Most of our viewers who saw the image posted agreed that the figure was frightening. A lot of people were genuinely concerned for her family's safety and recommend calling a priest. All these years later, the family and everyone involved still can't explain the ominous figure in the photo and say it's still incredibly unnerving to see. How many you got left? Only two left. So this bizarre little clip was shared to Twitter by Sidio Paranormal. It shows a couple of friends filming themselves goofing around. There's only two, so it's fizzy, it should work. You working? No. That's when suddenly this happens. Give it a bit. What's it? No, no, no. What, what? What? What's that? Dude, 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 dude. What, what? Dude. What? Look. What? Look. Let me out, let me out, let me, no, out, let me out, let me Watching that again, the camera holder is distracted by the door in the other room rattling. 
What's it? No, no, no. What, what? What? It then swings open and the ironing board falls over for what seems like no reason at all. What? Look. Let me out, let me out. The two men are clearly spooked and the clip ends abruptly. What, what? Dude, what? Look. What? Look. What the f let me out, let me out, let me no. out. Unfortunately, this is one of those bite sized ghost clips that have no information attached at all. No one seems to know where this was filmed or by who. So for now, it'll have to remain a mysterious snippet destined to be retweeted into the nether. What's that? Dude, 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 dude. What, what? Dude. What? Look. What? Look. What the f let me out, let me out, let me no. out. Urban exploration is a common source for truly scary videos, as more and more brave explorers take on the challenge of visiting some of the world's most haunted locations. In this video, YouTuber Terra Al Extremo visits an abandoned hospital in Tlatelolco, Mexico that many believe is haunted. Hospitals are a common target for urban explorers. In a place where many people live out the final moments of their lives, it isn't surprising that abandoned hospitals are often hotbeds of paranormal activity. There have been numerous reports of inexplicable supernatural events at this particular site, including the apparition of a young girl. The video we're about to show is riddled with eerie activity. The group sets out to investigate. To start things off, a subtle dark figure can be seen in a hallway adjacent to where the group is exploring. As the figure's so far away, it's hard to tell if it's something supernatural, or perhaps just another person exploring the abandoned building, or even a homeless person seeking shelter. But then, as the camera pans back to the host of the video, something unnerving happens. Keep an eye on the doorway just behind the man's right shoulder. If you slow the footage down, an eerie black shadow passes by the doorway, unbeknownst to the group filming. Seconds later, it passes by again. Later in the video, the group explores the rooftop of the building. The cameraman decides to poke the camera through a gap in a doorway that leads to a room that they don't have access to. Check out what the camera captures. There, standing at the back of the inaccessible room, is a solid black entity. If you slow it down, there's no defining features. It's just a solid black form staring at the camera. As the team investigates further, they begin hearing strange sounds. At first, you can hear some local kids playing somewhere in the distance. But then, a slightly more eerie noise comes from the room at the end of the hall. Take a listen. What makes this scream so chilling is that the team goes to find its source in the room ahead, but they find no one. Later, in a darkened hallway, they hear even more terrifying sounds. Listen. If you play it back, at first it sounds like a wounded animal. Oh, no, 
but the moans that follow sound distinctly human. <laughs> As if this wasn't enough to brown your trousers and leave immediately, the crew musters up the courage to press on. That's when one of the voices perhaps says the name Harry. It's very clearly a woman's voice. But the nearby rooms are completely empty. The group calls out to make contact with the person in the dark, but they don't respond. They continue to hear muffled voices talking and the sound of an object being thrown, yet the group never encounters another person in the building. At one point, it sounds like someone saying, shh. Again, there's no one in any of the rooms. The cherry that tops this trouser soiling adventure is yet to come. At around the 58 minute mark, as the group start to wind down the video, Keep an eye on the back of the hallway. If you slow it down, you can see another solid black entity crawl past. The group seems to have no idea. This clip has garnered a lot of attention within the paranormal community. With so much activity caught in just one video, the episode has been scrutinised and analysed frame by frame. Some think that a lot of the encounters can be chalked up to homeless people using the building as a shelter. But with so many voices, noises and visuals backed up by endless empty rooms with no one in sight, it's hard to tell what's real and what's not. And that's not to mention the strange black entities seen in rooms that you can't even get access to. All in all, this is truly a mysterious video. It goes for well over an hour and is packed with strange events, some of which we couldn't even fit in this episode. It's well worth a watch on its own, and as always, there's links in the description box below. Back in 2015, a farmer in Achakulak, Russia filmed this extraordinary footage. Take a look. As the camera holder walks through rural farmland some 400 kilometers north of the Georgian border, a heavy swarm of locusts fill the air. At the time this footage was captured, officials had to declare a state of emergency in the area. The locusts were devouring entire crops indiscriminately. Over 800,000 hectares of farmland was affected as the insects destroyed vast fields of corn and other grains. When the footage first hit the internet, many said it was a sign of the end of days. According to the book of Exodus, the ten plagues of Egypt were a sign of God's wrath upon the earth. The eighth great plague was that of locusts. Exodus 10, 3, 6 says, They'll cover the face of the ground so that it cannot be seen. 
They'll devour what little you have left after the hail, including every tree that's growing in your fields. So how would you react if a plague of locusts this dense hit your hometown? Would you run into it and film it, or fear the incoming wrath of God? In October 2021, a popular vape and e-liquid store in England purported to have captured evidence of a ghostly haunting in their basement. In the days leading up to the event, the staff at the Bennett's Hill store in Birmingham had suspected that the building might be haunted. The alleged paranormal activity got so bad that they set up a series of night vision cameras around the property to try and get some evidence that something strange was happening. Take a look at what one of their cameras captured. The building was once home to a bank dating back to 1835. In the clip, you can see the heavy vault door swing open in the basement of the building. According to the owner of the vape company, shortly after they moved into the building, staff were reporting noises and noted a strange atmosphere in the basement. According to historians, the building became a popular watering hole in 1883. Then in 1895, publican Henry Skinner sacked one of his employees, Arthur Allen, over a wage dispute. Things escalated quickly, Allen grabbed a gun and shot his boss in the cellar. Local legend says that Henry Skinner has haunted the basement of the building ever since. Since this eerie footage was captured, the vape store owner has maintained that it's not a trick of any sort and says to this day he gets freaked out when he has to go into the basement. Before we take a listen to some creepy sounds that have been captured in the Canadian wilderness, remember to hit that subscribe button then, tickle that little bell icon there and turn on all channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop every time we drop our scary and mysterious videos. In 2019, a clip recorded in the Canadian wilderness went viral after it captured some scary sounding howls emanating from the woods. Take a listen at what's been captured. Thirty-nine-year-old Gino Mikas was out hunting grouse in a forest in northern Ontario with his wife and grandson when they heard the unsettling noise. The group were in a rural area about 45 kilometres away from Sioux Lookout. Meekers told news outlets that at first he thought it might be a moose or a wolf, 
but the more he listened to it, the more he wasn't so sure. Biologists from Ontario's Ministry of Natural Resources and Forestry analyzed the sounds, but were at a loss to identify what could be causing it. They said it could be a large mammal, but ultimately couldn't say for certain. Mikas showed the footage to local elders and hunters familiar with the area, and they too couldn't explain the sounds. When the footage first hit social media, it faced some backlash that it might be a hoax. However, Mikas has staunchly defended the footage, saying that people can believe whatever they want, and that he didn't go out into the wilderness that day just to make a hoax video. Of course, a fair contingent of viewers declared the howling evidence of a Sasquatch living in the area. Ultimately though, even after experts in the field, elders and hunters analyzed the footage, there's been no definitive explanation for these bizarre sounds. Now, if you can't get enough of the old slapped ham, then don't worry, we've got you covered. Check out that creepy video on the top there. Otherwise, we have an enormous paranormal playlist there that'll keep you entertained well into the evening, we promise. Now, remember to leave us a comment down below and hit that thumbs up button. And that's it from me. I'll see you all next time. 